Hi, so here we have a problem which was sent by Mr. Dinesh Jangid from India and in this problem we are given these three triangles and then we also have these parallelograms and we have to find the area of the whole shape. So if I assume the base of this as X and its height as H then the area of triangle CEF can be given as half of X multiplied by H and the area is equal to 1 that means we can say X that is base multiplied by height is equal to 2 and since all these triangles since the triangle CEF and ICH are similar triangles and we know the ratios of the areas of two similar triangles is in the ratio of squares of their sides that means the ratio of the areas of triangle ICH and the area of triangle CEF which is equal to 4 is to 1 this will be in the ratio of the squares of their bases that is CH square and EF square so this is the ratio of the squares of their corresponding side that means the ratio of CH and EF is equal to 2 is to 1 and this will also be the ratio of their heights so if I assume the height of this triangle as H1 then the ratio of H1 and H which is the height of this triangle will also be 2 is to 1 so you can say this base will be equal to 2x and this height will be equal to 2 times the height of the triangle CEF and similarly you can say this base will be equal to 4x and its height will also be equal to 4 times the height of triangle CEF. So we know the areas of these triangles and the area of this parallelogram since BC is equal to 4x that means DE will also be equal to 4x and FG will be equal to 2 times x which is equal to CH and height of both these parallelograms will be equal to H that is the height of triangle CEF. So this is also equal to H and why is it so because BH is parallel to DE and the distance between two parallel lines will be constant throughout their lengths. So the area of this parallelogram is 4XH. The area of parallelogram is given as base multiplied by height and the area of this parallelogram will be equal to 2 times XH and XH is equal to 2 so this will be equal to 8 units and this will be equal to 4 units. So the total area will be equal to 16 plus 4 plus 1 plus 8 plus 4. So this is 33. So the area of this whole shape will be equal to 33. So that's all for this video. It was actually a very simple and interesting problem. So thank you Mr. Dinesh for sending this problem to me and if you also have any interesting problem which you want to share with us you can send your problems to the number shown on the screen and for many many more interesting videos keep watching MathSmart subscribe to it and don't forget to press the notification bell because then only you'll get to know about my new upcoming videos so bye bye till then